This Duke of Edinburgh Award is the Governor General's Dame Louise Lake Tax first, and she looks forward to future awards. I think the last one was in 2006, and I wasn't Governor General then. And uh, apparently, you have to wait until you have sufficient gold medals before you can have such an occasion. So I wonder when we'll have another occasion like this. So you have to work very hard. And especially because, what did you say these awards are given for excellence? I'm delighted to be here. The Antiguan Barbuda Defence Force plays a pivotal role in the program with the provision of guides, medics, physical training instructors, safety personnel, logistics support for school excursions, highlighting its commitment to the program and to cultivating young minds through the discipline. Executive Chairman of the Duke of Edinburgh Awards Program, Antigua and Barbuda, Lieutenant Colonel Edward Croft, supports the program as a possible solution to the declining values, ethics, respect for authority, and experiences which foster positive growth. Croft speaks of the benefits of the awards program. The Duke of Edinburgh's award is recognized as the best program for providing young people with the opportunity to set personal goals and achieve them. It allows them to develop self-confidence, self-reliance, leadership skills, build your all wrong character while making new friends and most important for young people, having fun. The executive chairman outlines the four sections of the program which has three levels of achievement, bronze, silver and gold. The service section which is intended to develop a sense of community and social responsibility. The adventurous journey section seeks to develop a spirit of adventure and understanding of the environment. The skills section, the skills section develops cultural, vocational and practical skills or hobbies. While the recreation section encourages improved performances and physical fitness. And there is also a residential project section for the goal and for persons 16 and over who are involved in an enterprise with persons not previously known by the participant. According to Croft, the program is recognized internationally by employers and persons involved in education. The Duke of Edinburgh Awards program is available to young people 14 to 25 years old who are committed with the ability to volunteer. The program is not a competition but a personal challenge tailored so that each participant's involvement is made to reflect that individual's starting point, abilities and interests. After achieving gold, participants are expected to transfer their skills and abilities into their communities. Sherilyn Beasley reporting for ABS News.